What up? Hold on, y'all. Hold on, y'all. What up? This is Devontae from Devontae's Paradise, and we got another brief intro. Man, finally, another female rapper. I think. I think I already have. No? no? Finally, Dej Loaf has dropped her first studio album, y'all. Finally, man. You know, um, I know, I know, let me, let me start off like this, right? Because with the high bridge cats and, um, this is Mrs. This is Mrs. Try Me. This is Mrs. Try Me, right? Now, uh, the, the interesting thing, this is where I want to start it at. The interesting, the thing that interests me about this whole thing is, um, uh, Days Loaf had tried me, and we're like, yo, like, when is she going to drop an album? And it took forever. And she dropped Try Me back in 2013, 2014. So it's been seven years. And is that is that right? 2013, 2014, 2013, 23 plus seven is 10. I think it was 2014, six years. So uh, we waiting, we're waiting, we're waiting. She got in a relationship with Lil Durk. Surprise little Dirk's not on this album. I don't know. But um A Boogie with the Hoodie comes out, right? I remember having a conversation with dad, with Pops, and we heard the a Boogie with the Hoodie song. Granted, Drowning is good. I look back in hindsight, I'm like, Drowning is good. But this is another thing that us humans do that is interesting, is just like we find one thing we don't like about a person, we don't even give them a chance or a shot. I think we got to start giving people more of a shot or a chance, you know, and um, a boogie with the hoodie comes out with drowning. I'm like, man, this dude sound like Dej Loaf. And, uh, <laughs> and sure enough, Lil B said it. And then they tried to jump Lil B for saying he sound like Dej Loaf. But that's what the people are saying. When you first started off, you sounded like Dej Loaf. You sounded like a female. And I know the high bridge cats, I gotta, I gotta be on my guard now with the high bridge cats, but you know, this is what the people are saying. This is what the people were saying. You came out sound like Dej Loaf. You know, and over time with consistency, eventually you, you become you become your own, and now Boogie with the Hoodie is pretty dope, you know. But I almost had a rent video about a Boogie with the Hoodie. I had a whole diss video crying for a Boogie with the Hoodie. Um, This was back in 2016. I didn't officially start my YouTube until 2017. So that video got scrapped. Now, uh, Dej Loaf, legendary Detroit rapper. I think she took her time because you got to, when you're from Detroit, you got to kind of go toe to toe with Eminem and Big Sean. Everybody in Emin, everybody in Detroit is listening to either Eminem or Big Sean. That's it. Or Dej Loaf, a little bit of Dej Loaf. So Dej Loaf knew she can kind of take her time, hone her craft. And Dej Loaf, this this album is good. I could tell this album. You could tell you know how you could tell an album is good by listening to a couple songs and you know, you might not enjoy it, but it's a solid album. So definitely go cop it. Let's go over the features. We got Big Sean, Gunna, 42 Doug, Sada Baby, Rick Ross, Benny the Butcher, Bodie James, Conway the Machine, Little Uzi Vert, and Black. So, Dej Loaf has finally dropped the album. Thank God, man. And it's a solid project. I'll be waiting for more Dej Loaf projects. Y'all let me know what y'all think. Like, comment, subscribe. This your boy Devontae from Devontae's Paradise. Anyway, peace. I gotta end this, man. I'm hungry.